What is up, you awesome kisters? It's Sister Reacts here, guys. Today, we're reacting to Xenoblade Chronicles X Definitive Edition announcement trailer Nintendo Switch. So, make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe to Nintendo of America, and comment down below. I like own Xenoblade Chronicles X, but like I've never played it, but I played all the other Xenoblades in their peak. Let's check this out. Where the audio at? Oh. All right. I can't believe Xenoblade Chronicles X is getting a port though. That's so good. Oh, it looks beautiful. I think I only played like 30 minutes of this game total. Like I got the Wii well, U game in my closet. Not too shabby, huh? I remember her, I think. <gasps> For a giant beached spaceship, anyway. But like it or not, this Look at the cats. I miss when graphics used to look like this. The city was modeled after back on Earth. We call it New Los Angeles. Oh. Welcome to NLA. NLA. Well, now I'm conflicted. Should I wait like a whole couple of months to play this game, or should I actually put this in my Wii U and finish it? I remember the United States ship. Ah, oh, Xenoblade. You gotta love those big open world environments, dude. They had cars in this and... Max? And like, I know Xenoblade always takes place in like different universes and stuff, but I know this doesn't take place in Shulk's or Rex, Rex's universe, right? This is, is this like something completely different like the, that, that they tried to do or is, I, don't, I don't even know. New LA was our beautiful lie to ourselves. So it looks like Earth was destroyed in this one. But they also got Nop on too, so I don't know. Dude, I actually got to play this game now. Like robots? Our native home was gone. Swallowed in a shroud of light, and our future was uncertain. We had no idea what fate lay in store for us, only that we had to keep living in order to see it. Oh, damn. Xenoblade Chronicles X. I can't believe they dropped this without like a direct, too. They just dropped this, dropped this. Who the hell is that? You here. Organization 13? Oh. Yeah, I remember seeing the date, March. Like, I really gotta wait till March, man. I would have bought this like in a week or so if it came out. Man. So it says, rebuild humanity and survive on a mysterious planet, Miro, in this open world RPG. This visually enhanced version includes newly story, newly added story elements and more. So yeah, I should probably wait. The Xenoblade Chronicles X Definitive, Definitive Edition launches March 20th. Okay. Huh. And they got new story elements, bro. Ah, I'm finding difficulty in waiting. I feel, like I, I feel like I should just play the original and then just go with a whole nother character again because I think to my memory there's like different like character classes you can choose at the start of the game so I could just like run a class and then just like play it again. But I'm, but I'm also remembering like there was like a whole online element to this too so is there going to be like online for this? But I don't know if the online was only working because of the Miiverse thing. But oh my god, like look at these sites, man. I'm like, like, I, I really love the, the sites and stuff in this game and like this car. Like I, I wanna, I, I wanna control this. This shit looks wild. Like it's like you're walking around with your own personal mechcon and shit. Anyway, yeah, if you, if you guys want me to check this game out when it releases, let me know in the comments down below. And uh, I'll see y'all later. And let me know about the lore. Like, wh wh where does this stand in between Xenoblade 1 and 2? Is this, like, all before Xenoblade 1 and 2? Is this, like, outside of their universes and story? 
Well, technically, I guess a universe would be irrelevant since this universe is all about hopping universes. So I guess is this like a universe like not associated with the Xenoblade 1 and 2 universe? But yeah, <clears throat> peace out.